Hey guys, just a quick announcement. I am starting a series um, denouncing celebrities and journalists, but mostly celebrities because they are unaware of their brainwashed by the media that um, promote boycotts to Israel and support terrorists unknowingly believing that uh, they are innocent and supporting um, groups that are targeting and murdering innocent Jewish children in Israel um, and also propagating the blood libel. Yes, some celebrities are indeed anti-Semitic, but I believe that some of them are actually innocent and unaware or too pretentious to recognize that they're wrong. Therefore, I decided that I would make um, a series trying to raise awareness to the propaganda that is coming out from the mass media. And you will see that a lot of celebrities are left-leaning, so they will believe in everything that CNN and other media um, defend and demonize everything that comes from news outlets that are conservative even when those news are actually accurate. So I'm starting this series and I don't know how well it's going to go because I'm all over the place. I think I may have ADHD <laughs> or some sort of it because I, I have a little hard time focusing but um, that's beside the point. So I'm starting this series uh, raising awareness uh, about uh, Israel and raising awareness about the propaganda that's going on against Israel and especially the fact that so many celebrities are propelled to take a stand on things that they do not understand and are misinformed on. So that's it for this video. And keep an eye on for, out for these videos that I'm going to upload. I think I'm going to start Russell Brand because Russell Brand has connections to the Labour Party and he has had or had or has. Um, I think he still maintains these views. He has been quite silent on the labor anti-Semitic thing, but still, I think he still upholds the same views on um, the Israel-Palestinian conflict. So I thought that I should educate his pretentious highness on uh, the reality of Israel and Palestine and educate him on the propaganda that he is basically being fed by everyone of uh, everyone in the media and uh, it's curious how they play that they're anti-establishment and they pretend they're so outside the, the, the um, you know and then they, they propagate the most mainstream views and do not seek the truth online. Even if I do not reach his royal highness, at least if some of his fans that have been brainwashed because of his views learn and do their research, many lives can be spared and a better understanding of the reality in Israel, Gaza, and Judea and Samaria can be spread and peace could be achieved if more information was um, available to those of us in Europe and the US and other countries cannot access because all the media has an agenda and a bias against Israel. So that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.